This was um, 34 years ago to the day, uh, 4th of November, 19, 1979. A day Ambassador John Limbert will never forget. He had taken a job at the U.S. Embassy in Tehran three months prior, not knowing that that may have been the worst decision of his life. Yeah, they, they came into the embassy grounds. Uh, we attempted to secure the building. Ambassador Limbert said the students didn't look as if they had any weapons, so the security officers were ordered not to hurt any of the Iranian students. But our original assumption was uh, that this would not last very long. Unfortunately, the government was not taking action, and the Iranian students were becoming more aggressive. Once the students got this, the attackers got into the main embassy area, what had begun as a 1970-style sit-in, uh, within a day or two, changed into a major international crisis. Ambassador Lindbergh was one of 100 Americans taken hostage by Iranian students when they attacked the U.S. embassies. Ambassador Lindbergh and the other prisoners were beaten and threatened every day. Lindbergh spent nine out of the 14 months captured in solitary confinement. On January 20th, 1981, Lindbergh was set free. For O-State TV, I'm Amy Jensen.